Uh, my name is Kevin Dotson. I'm the vice president for basketball footwear at Nike. I've worked with LeBron pretty closely for the last five years or so. He's highly involved and he's getting more and more involved from what I can see. I think he just has a total commitment to making the best products. He demands us to make the best products. And it's funny, you know, when we showed him the final versions of this and the color work and all the amazing stuff we did for life, he said, okay, that's the bar, guys. Now everything has to go up from here. And it was great. It, 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 you know, he was very clear about what he wanted. He was very clear about what he didn't want. And that really pushed us, I think, forward. And, and just as, as a partner to work with, he's awesome. You know, he's a, if you, if you talk to a lot of people that have played with him or you read what people say who are on his teams, he's a great leader, he's a great teammate, he's fun, and he demands excellence. And I would say he treats us the same way. We're like part of that team with him. And, you know, it's, it's an honor to, to be a part of his team. And, and uh, you know, he treats us as such. It's really cool. It's a, it's a great relationship. We're lucky to have him as a partner to make the next LeBron product, it's always a challenge because you have this insane athlete who's a big, explosive beast on the court. I think what we really set out to do with the 15 was to solve those problems in new ways. So instead of you know, maybe adding big structures to give support, we tried to do it in a much more minimal, simplistic method of make. And so what that ended up doing was giving us a really new, technically advanced way to make the Flyknit upper through Flyknit battle come to life. And then the same thing with the bag, on, uh, with the Zoom airbag on the bottom. You know, we've created a platform that gives you all the protection, cushioning, responsiveness you want in the court, but also has flexibility as well. And that's a really, really big thing to see, a shoe that has so much cushioning, but also the articulation so you feel comfortable and, and feel agile on court as well. For me, the Flyknit battle is really the is probably the biggest advancement because Flyknit is a great, great method of make for shoes. It's a great way to build shoes. It gives you great fit, gives you really great comfort out of the box. It flexes, it's breathable, it has amazing benefits for the consumer. But for basketball, where there's a lot of side-to-side -side cutting, it hasn't always been structurally uh, supportive enough for us to just use Flyknit alone. We've had to add maybe some components to kind of make it strong enough to, to support the cutting. With this shoe, with the Flyknit Battle, the team and the engineers worked really hard to try to rethink how we use structure in Flyknit to build out, to give all the support you need. So you still get that one-to-one -one fit, you still get that stretch and that comfort, but in the key areas where you need support or you need strength, durability, we've been able to knit that in and now you still have that sleek, lightweight, seamless fit, but you get all the strength. I think that's the breakthrough. Some people would probably say the bag because people love you know, zoom and, and big zoom max bags for their feel. But I, I personally think this, as we go to the future, is gonna be a big opportunity to continue to push the limits going forward. On the court, wear it off the court, feel confident in, in the style and the performance and everything combined. So as we started this one, the challenge was thrown down. It's gotta be the most innovative. It's gotta be one of the most uh, advanced from a style perspective. And I think when we got to here and we had our initial sketches in front of us, we said, this one's gonna be special. We think we have some on our hands here.